Hello Aries, welcome to Sidekick Tarot. I'm Ryan, thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading for you may be dealing with and what they're up to. And for more tarot readings after this, go ahead and check out my wife's channel, at Valve 3 Tarot, which is review as well. Thank you. <clears throat> I'll be starting by pulling their current or overall energy. <clears throat> and then we'll be going into clarifiers. Okay, I'll get the cards out first. <laughs> there you are. And then I'll begin. You pop in just to say hello, Aries, and then kind of just pop back out. A lot going on with them uh, a lot going on but jumping into this area is what they do show me immediately they are definitely working through something that is emotionally disappointing to them and i'm not too sure exactly what this could be but I, I do feel it is regarding their work their finances their career and investments um they do have quite a bit in place which they are remaining very hopeful about but i feel like for them it's an energy of yes they have so much in place that is going well for them at the same time i do feel that there is this emotional kind of yearning for something more uh, wanting to create more, wanting to manifest more. And so they are considering their options and their possibilities as to how to go about doing that. And there is a strong belief in what they do as well as within themselves, for themselves about this endeavor. That being said, they also are showing up with some sort of amount of abundance coming in. And this is fascinating because it's almost as if they're working towards this, they're considering what they want, and they're just going after it and getting it. And that being said, it's an energy of, okay, thank you. They're moving forward this mindset and perspective of growth and just let's expand, let's just keep moving. They are making very quick, decisive moves for themselves. At the same time, as they're making these very quick moves, they're also taking their sweet time to kind of process what their next move or next step is gonna be. And that being said, as they're processing everything, they are putting in more work and effort towards this. And what's fascinating is there is some sort of new love here. It's almost as if I feel like they are falling in love with their work, their career, their investments, whatever their craft is, or let's just say study. Um, it's interesting, though, because overall, yes, they are falling in love for this. At the same time, they're kind of like, hmm, where could else this take me? They are choosing to kind of wait here with this strong emotional energy. And it's almost as if they've kind of stumbled upon something here that kind of has stopped them in their tracks. It's almost as if here they are putting out so much work and effort and they weren't expecting this surprise in a sense. And now they're trying to figure out like, okay, which direction do I take things? But what's fascinating about this Aries is they're ultimately showing up with fate or destiny behind them. This is a very strong momentum because they are showing up saying, you know what? I know what I'm going after. I may be going through something difficult emotionally about this endeavor, but they're also showing up quite sharp and clear minded at the end of this saying, well, I wanted it and I got it. Okay, let's go ahead and jump into clarifiers and see what some of this could be. <clears throat> very driven, very driven. Yeah, yeah, it, it goes back to this energy of there is something that they want and desire here, but at the same time, um, I, I do feel it might be actually something between the two of you. You guys might actually have some sort of investments tied together. 
But ultimately, I'm not too sure exactly why this is. It's an energy of this connection between the two of you. They're going, it's fascinating because they're going through this emotionally, but it almost feels as if they're not really doing too much about it either. And that's where I'm kind of like, okay, so... Huh. Not quite decisive yet as to what to do about that, but when it comes to money, that seems like a little bit of an easy task. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Their, their belief, again, their belief system is I will find out what I need to find out and I will get what I want. <laughs> okay, they're, they're ultimately saying, well, whether it's now or later, I will find my answer eventually. Um, okay, I feel like they are. I feel like they are. There you are, Aries. Like I said, um, so this is what's fascinating is... They are, in a sense, considering their options, their possibilities. Um, this may sound a little blunt and harsh. I feel like you, Aries, are one of their options and possibilities. They're ultimately saying, I'm not too sure what I want. Do I want to be with Aries or do I not? Like I said at the beginning of this, they're feeling the way they are about this connection with you or possibly for wanting a connection with you. At the same time, they're kind of like, well, um, they're kind of having to go through this process of, do I want to be with Aries or do I want to kind of just leave Aries be? Um, and that's what's very fascinating is that there is this strong independent energy kicking in through here about what it is they truly want to do. And so instead they're choosing to focus more so on their work and their career in the meantime, even though the connection or a connection shows up here between the two of you, they're ultimately saying, mm, I don't know yet. I'm eyeing it, but I don't, I don't know yet. I'm not going to act on it quite yet. Mm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's <laughs> they're 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 trying to kind of push through this confusion. They're trying to push through this confusion, but at the same time, they they are battling themselves, and that's why they are in a sense of giving themselves some time. Excuse me to really process where they're at emotionally and mentally about this connection. I don't know if there's another one, but excuse me. I don't know why though. It feels as if they want to communicate and step forward, but they're just. There's something about it. There's something about it that's kind of keeping them back. And I don't know what that is. Ooh. Oh, geez. Um, yeah. Still undecided. Whoever this person is, Aries, they're on the fence quite a bit. They're on the fence energetically quite a bit. It's almost as if they, like I said, they're, they're more so focused on themselves and their finances and work and their career, but they're not ignoring the relationship or connection between the two of you. It's just an energy of, they're just not too sure. And that's what's interesting. It's almost like they're not necessarily having all these thoughts and this anxiety and fear about the connection between the two of you. It's like, okay, I know Aries is there, but I'm going to kind of just choose to do my own thing right now and figure out what I need to do. They're there though. That's what's fascinating. Oh, wow. Again, again. Oh, geez. I kind of feel like they're fighting themselves a little bit over this. They're fighting themselves. It's like they, they have so much emotional energy there to give and they want to work on things. At the same time, they're, they're again, they just show me the same repetitive energy of, I don't know. I just don't know. I just don't know. And it's like, Aries, I'm going to have to throw this one back on you and be like, do you want to be with someone that just doesn't know, that just doesn't know, that just doesn't know when it comes to, if you like me, just say it. Just be point blank direct with it. Don't know, but they are definitely in this energy of sharp, cold, and reserved at the end of this. So, well, of course, if you are dealing with anyone, we do have Aquarius, Sagittarius, Taurus, Aries, and that's it. Bye.